Hi everyone, I am Achal. Thanks for watching out this video today. In this video tutorial, we will going to discuss about the Shopify mobile application. So the Shopify mobile application is based on the Flutter technology and we do have this application available for both the devices uh, like for Android and iOS as well. Uh, to convert your Shopify web store into the mobile application, you can make use of this application that is Shopify mobile app. So, uh, before proceeding ahead, I would like to inform you like when you have installed this application, then you will get a prerequisite PDF file. According to that, you need to provide us the required details like app name, color, banner image and logo as well so that we can configure the mobile app for your store and deliver it to you. Before proceeding ahead, I would request you to please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon button to get more updates. And regarding the demo link, I have added the demo link for both Android and iOS in the description of this video tutorial. So let me take you to the front end of the Shopify mobile application. As you can see here, I have already downloaded the Shopify mobile application from the Play Store. And so let me take you to the work performance of this mobile application. As here, we are checking out the complete work performance, like how it will going to appear at the front end. In the left navigation, you can able to see like we are having an option sign in as a customer. You just need to tap over there and here you will get uh, two options like sign in with email or you can create your own account. So I am clicking here sign in with email. Now just tap over the sign in and you will get a pop up like successfully you have logged in into the mobile application. Okay, so here you can see it is our home page and you can able to see different product types which we have configured from the back end of our Shopify uh, uh, web store. You can able to see the complete home page products like we have uh, added with different uh, card types here. And as you can in the left navigation, you can able to see we are having different options. Uh, first, we are having the customer profile section. In this, we are having different options like account information. From here, you can able to update the uh, uh, account information as well. And like here, you can see my orders. You can check complete order list here. And in the address section, you can able to check the registered addresses and you can also able to edit the uh, uh, previous address as well. And you just need to tap over that submit button. As here you can see, we are also having contact us option. Uh, once you click over here, then you will drop an email so that we will get back on your queries. And here you can see we are also having this wish list option. You can wish list all your products. Okay, now you can also check your reviews which you have provided. You can check complete list in the my reviews section. And from last you can able to log out from this mobile mobile application. Now let me back to the home page. And we will be checking out the process of product purchasing. As here, you can see we are having different options available here. Like you can wish list your product, you can add to cart and buy now. And in the uh, last, you can able to get the complete description of this product. Now I'm moving forward to the buy now product. As once you click over the buy now, then you will be redirected to the checkout page. And you can able to see the complete information here. After that, you need to proceed with the shipping part. And after that, you need to proceed with the payment option. Now we will be moving ahead step by step. 
as uh, you can hit this email me with news and offers once you check mark this option then you will uh, get complete information regarding the news and regarding the offers as well now you, you need to fill here the shipping address as well like here i will be filling out after filling out the details you just need to update the state and you can able to proceed further and uh, you can if you need this information for the next time as well you just need to check that mark and press to continue to shopping okay uh, here i need to update the pin code i am writing here the pin code now i will be checking out over the option continue to shopping as you can see here i have added complete information now i there you will get an option you need to choose shipping methods like you can able to see here the standard method we are also having we are having heavy goods option as well now uh, you i have i have been chosen here the standard shipping method now you need to proceed further with the payment option so for that you need to click over the continue to payment as here if you are having any discount code then you can mark over here now you need to proceed further with the payment section so you need to add your card details here as i am adding some card details and if you want to change your billing address then you can use a different billing address from here or if you want to put, put this same as the shipping address then you can check that mark option as i have chosen the same shipping address and now i will be move ahead with the pay now option as you can able to see here your order being processed now you will able to see over the screen like your order is successfully confirmed and along with that you will get a notification as well so this way you can able to purchase your product like uh, the options which is available is once you uh, hit over the buy now option then you need to fill out the required details like information shipping address and then payment method and accordingly you need to proceed further this way your uh, order has been processed successfully now in the left navigation you can able to see we are having different options like here in category section you, we are having different categories okay and after that we are having different preferences as well you can change the currencies from here and uh, here we are also having language switcher option as well you can change the language from here and in the other section we you can able to see like we are having this option contact us you can contact us for any kind of concern or queries and we are also having privacy policy you can able to check out from here in the left navigation here you can check like we are having this change shop option as well you can also switch to other shop by entering your unique app id and just need to enter over the submit button now you can also having this option you can chat on whatsapp once you uh, chat uh, on whatsapp then we are we will be get back to your queries so i think we have covered all the part of our shopify mobile application so that's all about our shopify mobile app if still you are having any kind of concern or queries you can reach us at support at the date wapcool.com or you can also raise a ticket from wapcool.ubdesk.com i hope you liked our video if so then i would request you to please give us a big thumbs up lastly thanks for watching this video and have a great day ahead